Welcome to Snack Time with Big Nick. Today's snack, Ritz crackers. Shout out to Zach Lowe for sending us these. We greatly appreciate it. Let's start with the crackers. We're gonna go with the peanut butter. Ritz Bites. Mm-hmm, not bad. Me personally, there's not enough peanut butter on them, but I also know that she puts peanut butter in front of that shit. We'll give that a five. Ritz crackers reduce fat. The only thing that's fat on me is my fucking biceps. What we got going on here, buddy? Mm. You can't go wrong with Ritz. Pull one of these, beat the whole fucking thing sitting down, just hanging out. I'm gonna have the originals before I give that a grade. Spike it up a little bit. Okay. All right, here we go. Party size. The roof is on fire! Throw your crackers in the air like you just don't care about getting eaten. These definitely taste better. It's a great They just taste better. So I'm gonna go with the fact that these are a little bit more fattening. Why is it probably better? I'm gonna give that a four. And that's six. Next one we're gonna do, Ritz whole wheat. I love whole wheat bread. If I ever go out breakfast and they ask me what kind of bread I want, always wheat bread, not white bread. The whole wheats are good. They're better than the reduced, but I would still take these. So I'll go out five on that. We got Ritz Bites cheese. But the thing about these is sometimes the cheese is a little fishy. Say cheese. It doesn't even taste like real cheese. It tastes like artificial cheese. I'll give us like a four. All right, now let's get into the really good ones because I know these ones are gonna be good. The first one we're gonna try in the crispers of crispers. Made with real, baked with real cheese. Let's get that on camera, please. Baked with real cheese. Four cheese and herbs. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Now that's some good stuff. Very good. You can taste the different kind of cheeses in it. Got that nice little touch of herb in it. I like that. I'll give that a seven. Ah, Crisp Thins Originals. Family size. I mean, that's good. Very good. I'm gonna give that a seven also. We got Ritz Cheese Crispers Cheddar. Everybody knows Big Nick loves cheddar. Put the chit in cheddar. Simply. Ooh, that smells nice and cheddary. Blossoms. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. How about a fucking blossom of sauce? Just the right amount of cheddar. Sometimes the things get too cheddary. Yeah. No good. I'm gonna give that an eight. We still got five flavors to go. Crispin salt and vinegar. This could be very vinegary. Ooh, strong dose. Mmm, you're very good. A little salt and vinegar? Don't mind if I do. Ooh. Great one. Oh my god. That's gonna get an eight also. Tabasco pepper sauce flavor. Oh baby. Ooh, nice little kick. A little Tabasco. Not bad. I feel a little burn in my nose right now. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. I'll give that a six. That was pretty good. Ooh. Eh, eh, eh. We got a breaking nose alert. We got sour cream and onion. Oh. All right. Can, can I make a comment? <laughs> yeah. You know how we've always done all these snack times and all these chip, these bags of like half full and shit? Can we please get a view of this real quick? That's ridiculous. I haven't even had one yet. All right. So this is the bag in the beginning. Now this is what you're paying for. You're paying $3.99 for this. It ain't right. What kind of world are we living in? We got blue collar people that are buying this stuff. Mmm. This is delicious. Sour cream and onion. Very good. We have a new leader. Sour cream and onion coming in at nine. The race is not over yet. Oh! We got barbecue! Oh shit. Barbecue! Barbecue! Oh! oh. Wow, that's like you fucking bring right off the grill. Right shit. off the fucking grill, the fucking marinade still pumping oh. in the grill. I tell you, if I could make this a freaking car freshener, I'd do it in a heartbeat. <laughs> Don't know how much the girlfriend would appreciate it, but I got no so yeah, I'd be smelling steak the whole way to work. Let's get down to business. Oh! 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 Well, give me a minute, right? Oh! Wow! We got a 10! This shit's fucking more addicting than crack! I advise you don't go on crack. Let's see if the last flavor can give it a last punch. It's original. We shall see. I apologize. This one right here, Casey brings up a good point. We got original. This one's original with creamy onion and sea salt. I actually thought this was original because I didn't taste any creamy onion or sea salt in that. Goes from a seven to a six. All right, now let's see what the original actually is. See, even happens to the best of us. All right, here we go with the original. That gets a seven. There we go. Apologize for the technical difficulties here. Sometimes you can put shit in front of me, I don't even know what the fuck I mean, I'm just eating it. The champion of the Ritz crackers that Zach Lowe, all the way off of Cali, sent to us. Ritz barbecue. These are fucking amazing. I haven't had these in a long time. These things go into Big Nick's top 10. Just these ones right here. 
In the left corner, Big Nick's left hand, we've got barbecue. In the right corner, in Big Nick's right hand, we've got sour cream and onion. Who will win? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You're out! Barbecue is the winner! Da, 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 da. Got anything to say for yourself? Yeah. Give me some more of these barbecues. So there you have it. Big Nick snack time again. We hope you like the show. Like and subscribe. And yeah, we got more freaking snacks coming because Big Nick has got an appetite. He's always eating. He's always thirsty for more. We appreciate everybody that sent us snacks. Let us know what you think we should do next in the comments. We do have some other snacks that we still have to do. Maybe we'll do yours next. That's a wrap.